Welcome to our channel, and today we're going to help you understand the paper Video La Via, Learning United Visual Representation by Alignment Before Projection. The text provides an overview of research on unifying visual representation in large vision language models, LVLM, to improve their performance on downstream tasks that require understanding both images and videos. Traditional approaches have difficulty in learning from images and videos simultaneously because they treat them in separate feature spaces, leading to a misalignment before projection issue. The authors introduce Video LVA, a robust LVLM baseline that learns from a mixed dataset of images and videos and enhances the performance by aligning these visual mediums before projecting them into the language feature space. Video LLVA outperforms existing models, including Video Chat GPT, on various image and video benchmarks, demonstrating that a unified visual representation can improve multimodal interaction learning in large language models, LLM. The text also provides a comparison of different LVLM paradigms, showcasing Video Lava's approach of pre aligning visual inputs before projection, thus, granting the LLM improved comprehension of visuals. The research comes from multiple institutions in China and aims to contribute to the understanding of multimodal inputs for LLMs. The text discusses the challenges in learning a unified representation for language models that comprehend both images and videos. Existing approaches like XLLM and Macaw LLM incorporate modality-specific encoders and several projection layers, but they still significantly lag behind specialized video models such as VideoChat GPT. This underperformance is ascribed to a lack of proper alignment before projection, with image and video features existing in separate spaces. The discussed models, including ALBEF and VILT, have noted the importance of alignment before fusion in multimodal tasks. ImageBind LLM attempted to address this by pre-aligning modalities to a common feature space before processing with a large image language model, but faced issues related to performance and lack of direct video data knowledge. This work introduces Video LLVA, which is a new baseline for large vision language models, LVLM, that can process images and videos simultaneously by aligning their representations before projection to a shared feature space. Video LLVA demonstrates significant improvements in both image and video understanding when compared to other advanced LVLMs and dedicated video models. It showcases better performance in image benchmarks and outperforms IDEFIX ADB in MM Bench. For video understanding, it surpasses Video Chat GPT across several benchmarks. The key contributions of this work are the introduction of Video Love, which binds visual and language features, providing a solution for pre projection alignment and enabling visual reasoning for both modalities. Extensive experiments validate that unified visual representations improve LLM performance for handling both images and videos and capitalize on the complementarity of modalities. The text also briefly mentions the landscape of large language models and large vision language models. It compares various models, highlighting Video LLVA's unique approach in pre-aligning and joint training for both image and video modalities. This allows it to outperform models that are specialized for either modality or that don't require such pre-alignment and joint training. The text discusses advancements in large language models, LLMs, that can understand and interact with visual content such as images and videos. Specifically, it introduces Video LLVA, a framework designed to generate responses based on visual inputs without requiring pre-aligned image-video pairs in the training dataset. The LLM can act either as a scheduler, where it coordinates visual models like building blocks for various tasks, or as a decoder, a more focused approach with end-to-end -end training using human instruction datasets. Two approaches are outlined. One, scheduler-based methods, where LLM oversees various visual models as plug-and-play modules, requiring no end-to-end -end training, allowing for flexibility across different tasks. Decoder-based methods, which involve aligning image tokens to language models with various degrees of complexity and training styles, ranging from weak alignments to instruction tuning that leverage large human instruction datasets to train more powerful LLMs. The Video Lava model uses what's called language bind encoders to extract features from raw visual data. It stands out from prior work in that it goes beyond just aligning images and video features by also performing joint training on both 
allowing it to learn multimodal reasoning from a unified visual representation. This enables Video Lalave to effectively understand and interact with both images and videos, demonstrated by its superior performance on a range of datasets. The text outlines a method for generating responses from a large language model by integrating visual and textual information. The process involves using language-bind encoders to convert visual data, images, and videos into textual feature space, creating a unified visual representation. This visual representation is then processed through shared projection layers and combined with tokenized textual queries, which are input into a large language model like Vicuna, to produce relevant responses. Beyond simple conversion, the goal is to enable the language model to understand visual information by mapping it into a shared feature space, allowing the model to extract and use information from dense feature spaces of multiple media types. LanguageBind, which builds upon OpenCClip and Vital 10M datasets, helps pre-align image and video representations into this common textual feature space. Facilitating the process for the training pipeline, the model, similar to GPT series models, encodes textual and visual signals into tokens and maximizes the likelihood of generating a valid response, thereby enhancing multimodal comprehension. The model undergoes understanding training on image video text pairs and instruction tuning, where it learns to respond to complex visual comprehension tasks directed by instructions. Vicuna 7B V1.5 is used as the large language model with visual encoders from LanguageBind and a text tokenizer from LMA. Shared projection layers consist of two fully connected layers. For training, they use subsets of image text pairs from LAON CC SBU with blip captions and video text pairs from Valley. Instructional datasets are compiled from LLV 1.5 for images and video chat GPT for videos. The provided text compares various language vision language models, LVLMs, in the context of image understanding benchmarks. The benchmarks include VQA V2, GQA, VizWiz, ERI, VQA A, Pope, MMB, LLVABU, and MMVET. Among the methods listed, video LLV using the Vacuna 7B model achieved the best performance in eight out of nine benchmarks while being second best in one. It has shown superior image understanding capabilities by outperforming the state-of-the-art model Instruct Blip 7B across five question-answering benchmarks and being competitive to models that use significantly larger traditional LLMs. For training the video Lelave dataset, stage one focuses on single-turn conversation with concise visual descriptions, while stage two involves multi-turn conversations, emphasizing complex visual reasoning. During training, images are resized and cropped to 224 by 224, and eight frames are uniformly sampled from videos, with each frame undergoing image pre-processing. The data in each batch is a mix of images and videos. The training process includes one epoch with a batch size of 256 using the Atom W optimizer and a cosine learning rate schedule, and then stage two reduces the batch size to 128 with an initial learning rate of 1E3 and a warm-up ratio of 0.03. Additional details on hyperparameters are available in the appendix. Quantitatively, Video Leve outperforms Instruct Blip 7B by significant margins on multiple benchmark toolkits. It even surpasses larger LLM-based models on specific benchmarks, demonstrating its strong understanding of semantic scenes, which enables it to answer complex natural language questions based on images. Lastly, in the zero-shot video understanding, Video Lelave also outperforms Video Chat GPT in question answering accuracy on multiple datasets, showing its capabilities in large video language models. The evaluation follows the same method as used with Video Chat GPT and assesses accuracy and score using GPT Assistant. The given text details a performance comparison of different large language models, LLMs, on video reasoning benchmarks. The models are evaluated using a specific version of ChatGPT dubbed ChatGPT Assistant with the use of Video Chat GPT as a reference. In Table 3, various LLMs are compared based on their size, all 7B unless otherwise stated, and performance on datasets like MSVD QA, MSRVT QA, TGIF QA, and ActivityNet QA. Notably, Video Lava significantly outperformed other models, showing improvements across all datasets. Table 4 presents results of zero-shot object hallucination evaluation. Video Lava exhibited strong performance across three subsets, random, popular, and adversarial, outperforming both the MMGPT-L7B model and MiniGP4 Vicuna 13B. 
thus confirming the model's ability in object hallucination detection. Video Leve also displayed superior multimodal understanding capabilities, producing more comprehensive responses compared to GPT-4 in both image and video comprehension tasks. This indicates that Video Leve can effectively leverage a unified visual representation to understand both images and videos. Finally, an ablation study indicates that separately learning visual representations may lead to performance degradation suggesting the importance of a unified approach for visual representation in language models. Summary, the text discusses a humorous video showing a baby girl trying to read a book while wearing glasses, which is amusing and cute because of her facial expressions, movements, and the innocent curiosity displayed as she learns to read. There is also a mention of a beach scene with a city background, and no desert is referenced in the given context. The text indicates that when a red glove hanging from a chain drops, it will fall to the floor and potentially cause a blue ball on the bench to roll away, potentially disrupting a training session or making it hard to retrieve. The video also contains something strange, a giraffe doing a flip off a diving board, which is an uncommon sight. Additionally, the text relates to video Love A, a model demonstrating multimodal understanding capabilities across different tasks, such as image understanding, video understanding, and joint visual understanding. The model uses either a unified visual representation or a separated MAE image encoder for feature extraction. Results show that the unified visual representation outperforms the separated one in both image and video understanding tasks across various benchmarks, leading to better performance, reduced object hallucination, and improved optical character recognition capabilities. The provided text discusses the results of research involving Video Lava, a large visual language baseline model. The study focused on the effect of training techniques on performance in video and image question answering tasks. The main findings include, unified visual representations are important. When compared to separated visual representations, they significantly improve performance across four video question answering datasets, confirming that a unified approach helps the language learning model, LLM, to better learn and understand videos. In terms of image understanding, the study finds that joint training of images and videos, video LLA, enhances the LLM's ability to comprehend both, showing mutual improvements. Video LLA performs better than LLA only trained on images, on tasks that involve determining if visual questions are unanswerable or related to numerical understanding, reducing image hallucination and improving number comprehension. For video understanding, the model trained with both images and videos outperforms video LFA, a version trained only on video data. This suggests that joint training promotes a more effective understanding of visual content. A novel framework is proposed to address the issue of misalignment before projection. The framework utilizes a language bind encoder to integrate visual signals into the language feature space, aiming to improve the model's understanding of images and videos. Future directions of this study involve further exploration of the potential of joint training on images and videos to enhance the performance of language learning models in understanding and processing visual content. The summary abstracts the findings and methodologies described across different sections and highlights the overarching conclusion that onified approach to visual representation and the joint training of images and videos are beneficial for enhancing the performance of language learning models.